Hi guys, Tech James here. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to install OPL onto your PlayStation 2. So if you don't know what OPL is, basically it stands for Open PS2 Loader. And basically this allows you to load games off a USB hard drive or a USB flash drive. So the link is in the description. It's just going to bring you over to this PS2 um, homepage. Um, basically you just want to scroll down and you can find the latest um, builds of OPL right here. So as you can see it's actually updated daily so I'm not too sure um, how much it gets improved daily because I can't really see anything they can improve. But just click here to download it. So I'm just going to bring you to a new section. You just want to download the latest version which I believe is 0.9.4 beta so just go ahead and download that. So it's a very quick download. Um, head over to your downloads folder once it's finished downloading. All you want to do is just do right click and extract to OPL. So I'm just going to put it in a file folder for you. Um, you can just drag that out to your downloads folder. As you can see, all of the necessary files are in here. So all you have to do now is just make sure your PlayStation 2's USB is plugged in and literally just drag the folder to the root of it. Okay, so once that's on there, you can go ahead and connect your USB to your PlayStation 2 and I'll show you guys what to do next. Right guys, so once you're on your PlayStation 2, just make sure your memory card without OPL is plugged in. Make sure it has Free McBoot installed, and then just make sure your USB drive is plugged in. So once you've got both of those, you can just go ahead and power on your PlayStation 2. Right guys, so on your PlayStation 2, you want to go ahead and launch Ulaunch Elf. Just press X to launch it. If you have Free McBoot, then this will be installed um, by default. Press Circle to access the file browser. Scroll down to Mass and press Circle on that. Then scroll down to your OPL folder and press Circle on that. Now you need to select um, the OPL.L file and press R1. You then want to select Copy, just press Circle. Then you want to go to the top, press circle again, go back up to the top, press circle. Now you want to go to memory card zero, press circle on that, go down to boot. Then you just select one of these, press R1, and then just press circle to paste. It's then just going to paste across, so just give it a few seconds. It's got five seconds left. Right, so once you've got this in your boot folder, all you want to do is just press circle a few times um, at the top just to back out. Now you want to go ahead and just press the reset button on your PlayStation 2. So I'm just going to power off your console, just go ahead and power it back on. Right guys, from here you just want to scroll down to Free Boot Configurator, press X to open it. Then just choose your button layout, I'm going to use the X button layout, so I'm just going to press um, X. Then scroll down to Configure Let's just press X on it. So that stands for on-screen display settings, I believe. Then just scroll down to this one right here. Right, so keep pressing right on the D-pad until you get an empty slot. This is where you're going to install the um, OPL. So mine's number 15, so I'm just going to press X on that. Then you want to give it a name. This is the name it's going to display, so I'm going to put in Open PS2 Loader, or you can just give it any name you want. Just like that, I'm then just going to go down and just press X on OK. Right guys, so now you just need to select Open PS2 Loader, so just press X on Path 1. Um, go to Memory Card 0, scroll down to Boot, then press X on Open PS2 Loader, um, dot elf. Right, then you need to go down to Return, press X on it, scroll down to Return again. Then you just need to Save Config to Memory Card 0, just press X. You'll know it's saved when it comes up in red um, at the top. Then just scroll down and press X on Exit. So your PS2 is now going to boot. Press Circle to get off the memory card. Scroll down and there it is guys. Open PS2 Loader. So I'm just going to press X to launch into it. And here you go guys, the whole thing is working, so let's just go to the games list. Obviously I don't have any games because I haven't got anything like that plugged in. But yeah, so that's pretty much it for this video. So if you guys enjoyed, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.